back on the couch we are uh we are going to continue our watching of the pacific yes we are uh right now we're going to do episode seven mm -hmm. and follow six yeah yeah follow six that's mm -hmm. usually the the order, the order of things the big battle with for the airfield mm -hmm. it was sledge's first real taste of battle he sort of miracled his way from the beach to to where they had to fight and it was the first time they had to, to land on a beach and it was a hot Zone. And hot, essentially. This is like yeah. immediate right away. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Sledgehammer gets thrown right into it. He gets his nickname. Yep. And then we we have our Lucky and his last companion who's alive. Get, yeah, they get back to the boat. They yeah, get back to the that's boat. That's kind of where we left Both off. Both worse, worse for the wear. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, yeah, that's <laughs> but still left, alive. Which is always preferable. Pre preferable. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. uh, I'm going to... By the way, did you notice what I'm wearing today? My hat and my jersey. Yeah, you're jersey. you're decked out with. I'm uh, decked out with Carolina gear. Yeah. Do you know why? No. By the time this plays, uh, it will probably be what five or six weeks from when this happened. But yesterday, my Carolina Gamecocks, who I thought were going to lose sixty to nothing to Tennessee, which was ranked five. Mm -hmm. All you sports you people ranked? who hate don't like sports. Uh, sorry about this. Um, we are not ranked. Our quarterback, uh, Spencer Rattler, then kind of bit, he's kind noodle. of been a bit <laughs> mediocre for the Gamecocks, and he turned into fucking Patrick Mahomes. It was a total molly whopping. <laughs> a molly whopping. It was That's a the... molly whopping. All right. Um, so beat like they after saw. watching this, if if that Spencer Rattler turns up next week at Clemson. Mm -hmm. Anything's possible. So was it pretty much like back and forth, and then he just shot more, no. or was it just proud Papa? Proud Papa this week. Yeah. Anyway, I want to do a shout out to them and Spencer Rattler for like bringing the fucking A game. I mean, he can respect. <laughs> respect. Anyway, uh, let's dig into the specific deal. Unless you have some sports. No, nothing sports this. related. Okay, My team sucks. Right. <laughs> no, both, both your teams suck this year. Green Bay and Wisconsin. Uh, Here we go to Pele Lu. Zoom in. Sounds like such a nice place. Pele Lu. Pele Lu. Ugh, they get you with the opening shot. Yeah, well, they wanted you wanted uh, you wanted this. Probably making so little progress, or every time they think they're making strides. Oof. Yeah. Uh, is he marking days or he can't days? Be I think. Yeah, yeah. it can't be bodies. Be way, way more check marks. Is that a minesweeper? What's going on there? Or maybe they're paving the airway. Are they repaving it? It's like, is the airfield worth it? Probably, but whew. You gotta buy every inch of it with blood. See what I mean about their outfits being almost like kind of pajama -y? Yeah, I told, now I see it, yeah. You take all the gear off, like the guy right in the middle, it, it looks like pajamas. Yeah, everybody's broken. Nobody's speaking at all. These are the new guys, I guess. What's wrong with them? Remember when he didn't smoke? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> now he's a classic. What's the dude now? I need to okay, have an airfield. Mm-hmm. No, that's, you're right, they're repaving it. Why didn't I enlist in the Seabees? Could have come to Peleliu in the seat of a bulldozer. Any of you guys got a Jap sword or flag? I'll pay good money for it. Or a Jap a nap? Any kind of Jap weapon, I'll take it. Keep them in my ass. Reach up, grab what you want. Mm -hmm. you gotta get me a Jap sword. Can't go home from the war if you hand it. You can arrange for a purple heart. Any of you guys got a Jap sword? Fuck off. Go fight for one. Seriously. I haven't seen anybody get a sword yet. Never run when you can walk. Never walk when you can stand. Never stand when you can sit. Never sit when you can lay down. Never lay down when you can sleep. And never pass a supply of clean water. Amen. Got to have the flies are buzzing on different sides of my ears. It's <laughs> really annoying. Whoever the sound designer was a jerk. He wants an immersive experience. He's definitely giving me an immersive experience. I'm like... <laughs> He's looking a bit rough. He looks real rough. You're up, boys. Go get him! Is that Chuckler? Yep, yes it is. They said they'd lost him. How you doing? Don't not... look like he's doing good. What kind of man has already served his country as a soldier in the Philippines way before Pearl Harbor? Manning his machine gun throughout the fight, suffering horrible wounds while killing countless savage jacks in the key battle at Guanajuato Canal! Winner of the Congressional Medal of Honor! I kind of feel his uncomfort, com uncomfortableness now. Mm -hmm. That's got to be a little bit uncomfortable. You know, 200th, 300th time he's probably done this and exactly. he's just like... Each time it gets worse. Yeah. Do you know who Audie Murphy was? No. So he's an army guy who won the Medal of Honor. He became a movie star. I think he was the reverse of this guy. I think he loved the attention. Yeah, I think he loved it. Nice swing. Nah, oh. Not that time. Ooh. 
a great little montage there. Yeah. yeah. You should use gloves, my friend. Transferring that mental pain into physical just to feel something. He's yeah. driving him nuts not to be there. And every one of them would give their fucking left nut to be back where he is. Mm-hmm. Zone, dude. Did he? I think so. How long you people been doing this? You don't get out of your fucking hole at night because this is what happens. This is what happens. And right back into it. Mm -hmm. The bunker clear. We got it. Be clear. Why are you? Chaps in the bunker. First platoon cleared up with grenade. They're in there. Mm -hmm. I mean, just double check, man. Triple check. Dang. Yeah. Get a flamethrower. Seriously. <laughs> Nerve wracking. Lady. We have got to move. Go, 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 go. Sword. There's that sword. Oof. Intense. Intense close up. Ugh. Got yourself a sword, though. Brian, Well, that'll get the last few of them. Burning to death, though? Jesus. Please take him out. Thank you. End his misery. I don't they just surrender? Because they're jacked. I'm going to have to root them out one by one. Got that sword. I was digging his teeth out while he's alive. That man is on another level. Christ, put him out of his misery! Fuck off! Oh, that's not even Snap. That's not even the guy. Oh, I thought it was Snafu. Yeah. Thank you. Makes it easier. <laughs> to get his teeth, yeah. That is some gruesome ass shit. It's gruesome, bro. It's I, so gruesome. I mean, it was like a thing, though. I think, especially in G Vietnam, I uh, cut ears off. I'll get some more. Come on, take it. Lieutenant's too much of a nice guy. We're moving into the hills. Come to back. Does he have to come back? Right, sure. just... Bertie, I'm gonna need some of your mortar squad to volunteer to stretch your bears. You can't dwell on it. You can't dwell on any of it. Yeah, he's really taking them under his wing. Trying to watch out for his sanity. He's a good officer. Yeah. Try and get some rest, boys. He's no dyke. Great shot. Just walks off into the darkness. Ooh, great, great, great camera move. They're literally fighting an uphill battle. So many places for them to hide. Too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I'd rather have almost any other job than that one. Hell yeah. Did he just lose his leg too? Ugh. So many limbs lost. <laughs> Seriously, you can have the damn hill. Jeez. Oh, let's go. Let's get him on a stretcher. <gasps> damn it. Oh, fuck. Go forward, fall go back. Forward, go fall forward, back. fall back. Get... Pick up the body, then he gets shot. I know it sounds inhumane, but just leave him. Take him back. Oof, that one broke him. Come on. Let's get you out of here. Come on. I mean, when a man like that breaks. Mm. Did you see Haney? I saw him. Guy like that breaks. Yep. Guy like Jesus. And he'll believe he's dead. You can't dwell on it, Jay. Oof, way to pass that along. I don't care anymore. Just as long as it's quick. <laughs> Jets are everywhere. Trench raids. He is not okay. He is the opposite of okay. You'll be okay. Gotta poop. Gotta poop, gotta poop, gotta poop right now. Gotta poop, gotta poop, gotta poop. Oh, shit! <laughs> this is so embarrassing. Get him, get him Why'd you take so long to shoot him? Damn, Jay, if it ain't coming out your mouth, it's coming out your ass. Look <laughs> <laughs> like you in a sack race, Jay. <laughs> I'd be terrible. I shit myself. Yeah. Well. <laughs> Gotta have some moments of levity yeah, in this shit. Seriously. You left a trail, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you left I mean, I don't blame him. That'd be terrifying. <laughs> 
were having too much fun watching them. <laughs> they really were. I think I might do the same thing. This whole place looks like just ambush alley. Oh, totally. They get like I said, there, there's they can just hide in any crevice, any hole, any little cave where you're about to take a poop. Yeah, I mean they're just everywhere. Sniper got the skipper. Akex dead. Shit. Akex dead. Man. <clears throat> that was quick. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he felt that one. Yeah. He really felt that one. Yeah, kind of universally loved that guy. Mm-hmm. Can't let any of it get to you. His father was right. It's kind of like rip his soul out. You know? Mm-hmm. <laughs> This actor's doing something special because, like, you can just see every ounce of, like, his sweet pureness just going away. <laughs> going away. Ooh. Ooh. Jesus. It's like half a dude's head, though. Yeah. Oh, good lord. That's pretty gruesome. Is he dropping those in yeah, his head? Yeah, he's dropping. <laughs> he's such a fucking weirdo. <laughs> this is just next level. That is some fucking sick ass shit. Yep. Oh, there's some gold for you. Oh, and that's the last step. That's Is the last. Do it. What you doing, Sledgehammer? I thought I'd bag me some chap gold. You don't want to do that. Don't. This is the last ounce. You shouldn't do it. Uh, don't, don't do think, it. Think you'll don't, do it? Don't do it. You think you'll do it? Well, is it all right with you if I cut a his insignia then? That best muster with you? He'll probably go in there right afterwards. Yeah. He well, probably just he's, wants he's, them for himself. I do think he's trying to actually hook. Help him hold on to some of his humanity. He's like, you don't want to be a sickie like me. Yeah. Dropping rocks in a fucking dude's bullhead. Oh, now they're the ones coming back. Mm-hmm. Why are there replacements, though? I don't think he took that Japanese sword. No. I didn't think that he shit would have been right well, in the Well, he, he, he had, yeah, he had the, um, he had his little smaller one. He left that bayonet. Yeah, no, he, he left, left that bayonet. Too. Yeah. yeah. God, get me off this damn island. Whew. Well, now we're on to some other horrible, despicable place. Pavuvu again. So D Day is what uh four months old at this point. Some lemonade? Hell yeah. yeah. What the hell are they doing here? Something sweet for you. Okay. Thanks for the Hi, welcome back. Good to see you. It's like in shock. Okay, Marine. You've had your look, see, now move along. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> Talk about a thousand yard stare, dude. It's like literally he forgot what that entire world was like. Yeah. He's aged a bit. What is he, 19 now? Yeah. 19 going on 87? Yeah. After, what, a month, two, a little go. swim. Good Lemonade in the swim. Beach, yeah. Whew. Well, that place sucked. That sucked a lot. Peleliu sounds like a horrible place to visit. Where yeah. hope goes to die. Yeah, well, no, that's Pavuvu. That's Pavuvu. Oh, yeah, the Pavuvu's word. I think Peleliu might be where Pavuvu goes to die. <laughs> Yeah, any loaf left over it is like gone is, there. Yeah. yeah, I don't. I can't think of any worse place to be. That that place was an entire death trap. Yeah, it was like just you know the the terrain and stuff and being in those little passes and shit. This is like a horrible, horrible place to have to fight. At any corner, any moment, you get sniped or, or someone jumps out of a, out of a hole, hole or in a bunker yeah. or whatever. Yep. Your fucking captain gets killed. At uh, night, people are jumping in your yeah, holes you and killing you, you have no rest. It's like horrible. That whole episode was sledged. The, except for the little uh, segue to Barcelona and his uh, golf course antics. Mm -hmm. um, that whole thing was, was all sledged. Sledge. He ages in that episode a thousand years. He's like... In those two months or however long it was, yeah. Everything his father said to him, warned him about, is coming true. It's like... A, and I wonder how many times when he was over there... In real life, he was like, Jesus, my father was so right. Yeah. Oh. He must have just been like, I should have listened to my dad. You know, it's just an ugly war. Uh, highlight moment for me is the throwing the fucking rocks into the <laughs> into fucking dude's brain. head. Tell into what brain. was his brain. So now it's just a fucking cup with whatever remains of his brain cells that in That man it. is just a special. He's special. He's, he's so special. And I, I do like how he get. I feel like he's trying to save whatever humanity is left in Sledgehammer. 
Yeah, maybe. Because he could have, he didn't have to talk him out of that. Maybe he's just like, yeah, you don't want to be a low class piece of shit like me. You know, you don't want to go down that low road that I constantly seem to go down <laughs> of throwing <laughs> rocks into people's brains, of digging teeth out of their mouth. I think even Akak was trying to keep him a little bit, you know, trying to just let me help you try to, but he's. Yeah, focus on your job. Focus yeah. on, you know, don't dwell on shit. Just keep going, keep moving forward. But then, of course, he dies. It's like, how do you. You know, how do you let that go? Because that's like a big deal. Okay. Well, this, yeah. is, this is a tough episode, but I mean, it was like very straightforward. Where, you know, Sledge is clearly like our main character now where it's been Lecky for most of the series. So mm-hmm. now we're really following Sledge at this point. And so he's getting an education in what this war is. And I think that shot with the woman there is like, he's just like, what is it? What's going on? You know, it's like you've moved from this horrible place and now you're confronted with this totally separate reality of like, a beautiful girl and she's being nice to you and like lemonade sweet lemonade and, yeah, exactly. it's like it's like something left from home but that seems so far away it's almost like insulting to be like welcome back like yeah <laughs> welcome back to normal normalcy kind of Wait. literally that lieutenant who said something to him like when he looks over it's like if looks could kill oh he, for he sure been dead a thousand times yeah yeah i'm surprised it didn't do like a scanner's like brain explode type <laughs> oh. of deal guys thank you so much uh we will of course see you in the comments uh, like subscribe like and subscribe <laughs> and uh hit us up on our socials social and patreon and, and we will see patreon. you next week yes yes madness